Hey, what's happening, Stinky Heads? How you doing? How y'all been? What's happening? What's happening? What's good? Hey, before we get this video started, you already know, go to smash that thumbs up. You know what we're trying to do. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. In this video, we got that what? Weekly. That weekly. Weekly. Yes, sir. That weekly. Mm. So these are the shoes that are coming out from 8th of December through the 14th of December. I'm going to go ahead and start it off. Coming out on December 11th, Drake released his Nike Air Force One Lover Boys again. However, this one is taking a little turn, meaning that he's coming out with two new colorways. One of them is a light purple, and the other one I'm going to call Lemon Drop. And looks, <laughs> it's all yellow. <laughs> <laughs> these are both just basic shoes. We've seen these before in all white. However, the upper of the light purple is light purple, and it does say lover boy on the side and if we look at the back we do have that knock the branding on the left shoe with the nike air on the right shoe nothing really stands out about the shoe except for it does have a white translucent sole which i do think is a nice touch and then the other shoe is completely yellow a monochromatic yellow including the outsole and again this shoe does have those knock the branding on the back so let me know down in the comments are you rocking these or dropping these but as for me I'm dropping these. Uh, one, I don't think this was a good. They kind of like Easter shoes to me. I think they're coming out the wrong time. This is the winter months, and why we're releasing these light pastel shoes. But if you are a fan of Drake and do hit collect the Nocta Air Force Ones, let me know down in the comments, sneakerheads. What do you think about these, my brother? Come on, man. You shouldn't even have to ask me. I'm dropping those, man. <laughs> I'm dropping those. But hey, hey, hey. You want me to get you a pair? <laughs> two thumbs down, right? Hey, drop us a comment. You drop, you rocking those or dropping those. They don't even deserve a comment to come out with them shoes, you know, during Christmas. <laughs> you mentioned, man, them shoes are strictly Easter bunny shoes. So, <laughs> hey, nah, man, drop us a comment, man. You rocking those or dropping those. But my brother, I'll be dropping those. Yes, sir. What we got next, my brother? So on December the 14th, MJ is coming out with those Air Jordan 11 Legend Blue. This is a family size shoe. Men's are going for 230. Um, Gray School, aka Bay Bay's, are going for 185. Little Kids Pay's going for 100. And then the infants and toddlers are going for 85. Basically, this shoe here is just giving a nod to um, MJ when he was with the Tar Heels and drafted with the Chicago Bulls. This shoe here was first worn back in 1996 at the All-Star Game, right? So, you know, it's true to form. You know, what I love with this shoe is it kept it, kept it the same, you know, that all-white uppers, right? But then it kept the patent leather mud guards, which I do love. But then when they went to the suede upper by the eyelids, I really like that, how they incorporated that suede. Usually it's the mesh, but this time they went with the suede. I like how they kept the, the, the black liner, you know, the interior liner. I like how they kept the, you know, the MJ23, you know, sporting that. I really love that. But then, too, if you look at the jump man, normally you get the jump man that has that that metallic look, right? Yes, but sir. um, yeah, but um, this time this time they went with that stitching. I really love that stitching, right? I just don't really get coming out in the winter months with this shoe because this shoe is a very clean shoe. I can see this shoe um doing quite well because you know most people are fans of 11s. I am a fan of 11s, and you know it is just the timing of the year that they came out with that. But I will be rocking those. I will be rocking those. What about you, my brother? Well, you already know I'm rocking these because it has that. Carolina Blue in there. Uh, let me know down in the comments if you want to see my collection of Carolina Blue shoes. But unfortunately, this shoe is already forming on the retail. <clears throat> uh, for some reason, why the UNC colorways are not doing well this year. And this is another shoe that performing in the retail. Most shoes have been selling a lot on stock eggs for about $201. My size right now, size 10 is going for 204 My brother's size a little bit higher, size 12, 255. But, but again, that is reasonable because this has an elevated price point of 230. And that means after taxes and shipping, 
and you will be paying even from Nike $247 here in North Carolina. So they're only going a little bit over retail right now, even in the bigger sizes. So plan to resell these. I do not recommend bodies for resale, personal only. But I am happy because it looks like I will be able to get me a pair with ease. The rumor is to have a million pairs releasing, but only time will tell. And I uh, believe that everybody that wants a pair should be able to cop them a pair pretty easily. But, but still, go ahead and do your raffles, sneak your heads, and wish you the best of luck. <laughs> So moving on to another shoe. On December 12th, we do have a Nike Kobe 9 Pro Tro Elite. This is a high top shoe. So as you know, Nike has been releasing these Kobe 9s this year. And we really appreciate them because most people couldn't get Kobe's before. So we're glad that Vanessa Bryan is working with Nike brand again and releasing these shoes. So this shoe is called the Nike the Kobe 9 Elite Christmas. It does for the feature predominantly red shoe. Again, is that high top. They'll see to that black swoosh on the side. It looks like a camel print throughout right in the midsole. You do see that black carbon hit on the back of the heel. I do think that's a nice touch. Moving around to the toe box, we do see those red laces in there. It looks like some nice line knit and on the upper, which I do think that's a nice touch. But we do see nine lines on the back. And if you look at the very top, it does have some branding that says KB for Kobe. And it says the ninth, meaning that this is the ninth Kobe that was released. And he has like nine lines down on the back of the shoe. And we look closely at the very bottom on the heel tab. You do see that Nike Kobe Stealth branding the bottom. Moving around to the bottom of the sole. You do have that nice Kobe traction that everyone loves. Again, in the pod in the middle is green with that, that Kobe branding. And then we do see that the insole does have a little nugget that says Mamba Greeting with a snake in there. I do think that's a nice touch. You know, make the shoe a little bit special. And let me know down in the comments. Are you rocking these or dropping these? I will be rocking these just to the beast and what Kobe meant to the NBA and to this world. Let me know down in the comments if you are you rocking these or dropping these? What do you think about these, my brother? You know what? I'll be rocking these. Like you said, I'm glad Vanessa came up to live out, you know, Kobe through his shoes, right? So I appreciate that. I'll give you a round of applause for that. So um, I really appreciate that. But I'll be rocking those, especially they coming out right at Christmas time. And they got those Christmas, you know, vibe going with the color, right? With the, you know, the color. So I will be rocking those. Hey, drop us a comment down below if you're rocking those or drop. Just so you know, I uh, do expect these to sell out. The last Nike Kobe 9 Elite Pro Tro, the Halo, the all white pair did sell out. Uh, they're not going much over retail. They're actually performing under retail. My size, size 10 on the white pair is going for 218 on stock X, but I do expect these to sell out. So if you do enjoy wearing these Kobe's, go ahead and do your footwork and we wish you the best of luck. Yes, sir. Hey, and if you guys continue to love content like this, hey, check out that video right there. And like we say for sure, when you're blessed. Hey, bless others. Peace.